What is going on everyone? Platinum Bees coming at you with yet another video. Today I have a very special reveal to make to you all and that is I purchased my very first Platinum British Sovereign. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay guys, so very unique coin reveal to do today. If you didn't know, there is and exists such a thing as a black platinum sovereign coin from the United Kingdom. Now there's some interesting points about this coin that I'm going to share with you all, but first and foremost, let's get into this reveal. So without further ado, here we have it. So as you can see, this is a graded coin. It is graded 69. Proof 69, so it is a proof coin. The 69 does not add a whole lot of value to it. And as most of my followers know, I'm not a big fan of the 69. However, I wanna mention a couple of reasons why I picked this up. So I got this for a very, very decent deal in my opinion. I got this for a very, very low premium considering the coin and the collectability of it. And this is a coin that I have wanted for quite a while and it's very hard to find in a raw form as it is. So. This being graded, I bought this with the mindset of I'm buying this coin. I did not buy this in the mindset that I am going to just make money back on the grade that was given to this coin. But let's go ahead and take a closer look at the coin and see the details that it has. So this is a very awesome coin. This is the very first ever platinum sovereign. It is a half sovereign, so it's not a full sovereign. But this is a 2017 mint coin, and it commemorates the platinum anniversary of Elizabeth and Philip from 1947. So that's about 70 years anniversary that these platinum sovereign coins were minted. And these are the only platinum sovereigns to be minted as of late or as of yet. And they are epic additions to, for, to the platinum stack for sure. So as you can see there, it's just an awesome, awesome pickup and an awesome, awesome coin for sure. There's some great details on this coin and I am super stoked to have this as a part of my stack. Now I do plan on trying to get the full Sovereign and perhaps um, some of the larger sizes. I believe these go all the way up to like 10 or 20, some crazy number Sovereign. So these do go over an ounce in weight. Now, one thing I want to mention is that this coin did come with the certificate of authenticity. So we're gonna go through that and dive into a little bit more of the details about this coin. Basically, this is the Royal Platinum Wedding Anniversary, 1947 to 2017, Platinum Half Sovereign. This is the certificate of authenticity. And let's look at a little bit of the details about this coin. So this is a year of issue of 2017. It is made of 395 platinum, which is the standard. Its diameter is 19.3 millimeters. It weighs four grams, which is around 1.285 troy ounces. So it's a little bit more than a 10th of a troy ounce. It is a half sovereign denomination. It has a mintage limit of three nines. So less than a thousand of these coins were minted. So that's pretty cool. The issuing authority is Alderney. So an interesting thing about this coin is the coin that it, or the country that it actually is denominated from or, or its currency is valid in is Alderney, which is not the United Kingdom, right? Now, I've done a little bit of research into Alderney. It seems like it's like basically a province of the United Kingdom or, or some type of uh, collaboration. I believe it just, I believe it's one of those very small places that still lies under British rule. Maybe someone can correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not that familiar with the country of Alderney, but it is an interesting thing that this is not a royal mint coin. This is a coin minted for 
and by the country of Alderney. And so the interesting, another interesting point about this coin is it was minted and manufactured by the Commonwealth Mint. So it was not actually minted by the Royal Mint, which is another interesting fact about this coin. Now it is a sovereign coin and it does have a value attached to it. So it is monetized. However, it's definitely different than your average Royal Mint Sovereign. So we're not going to read all of this, but we'll get into a little bit of it. Basically, what this talks about is the marriage between Elizabeth and Philip and their wedding and things like that. Basically, there's 70 years of marriage being celebrated here, and it's what they consider to be the platinum anniversary. So if you want to pause this video and kind of read this, you can. However, I'm not going to go through too, too much of it. But this is epic for sure. And what's cool about this is it gives me number 20, 2, 233 of three nines. So it's number 233 out of 999 coins. So that's interesting as well. It talks a little bit about the reverse and the obverse and things like that. It is a proof coin, so it is minted in proof form. And... It's just an epic pickup overall. So as you can see there, there is the Commonwealth Mint insignia. And basically what I've come to know about the Commonwealth Mint is they mint coins for other countries, right? They're one of those mints who kind of contracts themselves out to make pieces for other countries. They are not the Royal Mint. They are separate in a way, right? They do mint sovereigns and, and British things. And a lot of what they have to offer is either British or Australian or what have you. If you go on their website, which I will link down below, you can see all of their offerings and they have a lot of collectible numismatic stuff that you can find from them that they mint and they mint a lot of other foreign nations coins on behalf of those nations. And so this is just an epic pickup overall. So super stoked about this guys. Let me know what your thoughts and opinions on this coin are. Do you like it? Uh, have you already, did you already know about this coin? Did you not know about it? Let me know all that down below. But overall, guys, this is an epic, epic addition to the Platinum Stack, a half sovereign coin, and it's graded to boot and it comes with the certificate of authenticity. It can't be beat. I got this for, I believe it was about 160 or 180 or something like that. So it was not very high premium at all, like I mentioned, guys. And so I'm super stoked to have this a part of my stack. I don't really care about the 69. I just care about simply having the coin and the fact that it came with the certificate of authenticity. You can't really beat that. So with all that being said, guys, I appreciate everyone for stopping by and checking out the video today and watching me reveal my latest platinum pickup piece. Be sure to hit the like button down below. That really helps me out a whole lot. Be sure to hit that subscribe button down below as well so you can stay up to date with future updates on my channel. Leave me a comment in the comment section down below. Do you like this piece? What are your thoughts on it? I know a lot of people don't like the queen on their coins, so a lot of people probably won't like this piece, but if you are one who does like it, let me know that. And if you don't like it, let me know that as well. But with all that being said, guys, I appreciate all of you. And until next time, we will see you.